Hello and welcome to another episode of Mason's Chicken Sandwich Reviews. Today's a great episode for two reasons, I'll tell you why. One, it's May, which means no more sweaters, all right? Number two, it's our Mother's Day episode, and that means I have a special guest coming on today's episode. So to honor the great day of Mother's Day, we went to Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen, because Queen. In my head, it made a lot more sense. We have Dairy Queen's Crispy Chicken Sandwich. I paid $5.79 for this sandwich right here, so it is a bit expensive for a standard chicken sandwich. But nonetheless, I gotta try it. I gotta see how it is. Look at that. Happy tastes good. Don't know what that means, but uh, give that marketing guy a raise. Here is my special guest for the Mother's Day episode. Hi, Mom. Hi. All right, this is my mom, everyone. So we have her here to help me test this sandwich. All right. Okay, we have a wrapper. No wrapper. foil. No foil. And no, there's nothing wrong with plastic. Fine. No, nothing wrong with it whatsoever, but uh, um, you know, when you're paying almost $6 for a sandwich, it's, it's paper. Yeah, it's not as good as foil. Foil just has a certain weight to it. So, thoughts, it's warm. It is warm. Right First thoughts. The bun just looks pretty. Yeah. And actually, the whole sandwich just looks pretty. Lettuce, tomato. Nice and warm. A little heft. I like the soft bottoms. It's honestly soft on both ends. Pretty looking sandwich. Oh, that's, that's a nice, pretty, pretty picture. So we got a tomato here. I'll leave the tomato on there for you, Mom. Uh, we got some lettuce. Do we have any other... Oh, we have mayo. We have tons of mayo on there. Everything looks fresh. Honestly, just fresh. All right. Hmm. I'll bite over here. Still crispy. Impressive. That's only. Mm. Mm. It's good. But you know what I don't like about it? The tomatoes. If you want to bite it, you can hold on to the tomato, Mom. You can bite it with the, the with the tomato. So I'm going to eat this without my tomato. Tomatoes are good. Honestly, when I'm eating it, all I can taste is the tomato. That's the thing. The presentation and the way it's like uh, it's put together, very pretty, like a very thick tomato dollop of mayo on there. But what I will say is that there's not a lot of flavor in the chicken. It could use they could use a little salt. It could use a little little pizzazz. Yeah. A little cayenne would be awesome. Maybe some sriracha would be nice. But I can't be too mad when it's when it holds together this well. There's nothing wrong with it. It's definitely what you think Dairy Queen would have for a chicken sandwich. It's nothing fancy. Mm. The bun has, has is, is doing everything the bun should be doing. It's warm, it's holding it together. It's still soft. It's not that bland white bread taste. Tomato was a little off season. The lettuce wasn't crispy. I didn't get any crunch from the lettuce whatsoever. There wasn't any part where I was biting it and I was feeling that uh, iceberg. Now maybe had you eaten it right away, not 20 minutes, Maybe. Later. Maybe. 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 The mayo, mayo's fine. Mayo's mayo. And the chicken, it's crispy. It looks nice. It's a fine size, but again, you're paying almost six dollars for this. You want a little bit more. You want a little bit more flavor. My final thoughts and my final grade, six point... I would have to say... 6.35. 6.35. Exactly what I was thinking. I love it. Dairy Queen, you tried. I We appreciate everyone coming up to bat. All right, everyone gets a turn. If, if this was a baseball order, I would put them batting sixth, all right? After, okay. the, after the power hitters. But Dairy Queen, thank you for thank you for playing today. And Mom, thank you for coming on my show. You're very welcome. I love you. Thank you for having me. I love you too, baby. And uh, everyone have a great night. And make sure to follow me. Bye-bye. <laughs>